Hey, what's up YouTube? Your boy Chris in the Caliente Garage. In this video, I'm gonna be changing out the left and the right gas spring on my Ion trailer lid. These are the original gas springs that came with the trailer. They come with a 60 pound lift and they extend about 20 inches. I'm gonna be replacing them with some struts that I picked up online at Walmart. These actually come with a 50 pound lift, but they extend out about 23 and a half inches. So as a result, it's gonna make the trailer lid open up even taller when it's time for me to load. Right now, it opens up to about 33 inches. So when I install these replacement struts, that's gonna open it up a little over three inches taller. It's gonna make it easier for me to load the trailer when it's time to take a road trip. Using 50 pound lifts will also reduce the stress that's on the fiberglass when opening the trailer lid. So this installation is gonna be easy. It's only gonna take about five minutes. So let's get started. Okay, one of the first things you want to do is you want to remove the gas spring off of the ball socket and to remove it off the ball socket, you need to take something like a flathead screwdriver or a pry tool that you can get in behind the ball socket. Uh, behind it is a little retainer clip located on the backside that holds the ball socket onto the 10 millimeter ball. You want to get something in there like a small flat screwdriver or something pointed that can release the retaining clip that's located on the back side of the plastic ball socket. Once you remove the retainer clip back just a little bit, the plastic ball socket will remove from the 10 millimeter ball. To remove the bottom portion of the gas spring, you want to remove the plastic ball socket in the exact same order that you remove the top. You want to get something flat like a small screwdriver and just get behind the backside of the retainer clip. Once you get behind it and release it, then you can remove the plastic ball socket from the 10 millimeter ball. Now let's get a closer look at what it takes to actually unlock the retaining clip on the back of the plastic ball socket. I'm using a flat screwdriver to get behind the retaining clip while I use a second instrument to keep the retaining clip in the open position. To reinstall the gas spring with the retaining clip in the unlock position, snap the plastic ball socket back onto the 10 millimeter ball, remove the instrument to lock back the retaining clip. In this portion of the video, I needed to open up the lid of the ion trailer to a higher position so I use a ratchet and cargo bar this allowed me to reattach the longer gas spring and snap back the plastic ball socket on the 10 millimeter ball the ratchet and cargo bar allowed me to open up the ion trailer lid to the desired position The installation process on the right side of the trailer is the exact same as the left side. Reattach the lift supports. Okay, this is gonna conclude the installation of the replacement lift supports gas springs that I installed on my Ion trailer. I will include a link at the bottom of the video where I actually purchased these replacement gas springs. 
I actually love the way that it turned out because now it raises the Ion trailer from 33 inches to 47 inches, which is much greater than I actually expected. If you guys have any questions or any comments, feel free to put them down in the comment section below. If you like this video, be sure to hit the like button. And if you haven't already, subscribe to this YouTube channel. This is your boy Chris, and I will talk to you guys later. See you.